hi guys my name is carol you're welcome to my channel this message is for aisha and odogo please aisha and odogo i need you guys to please come back together talk talk over the issues at hand odogo i know we all make mistakes I know you've made a mistake and I know you've been apologizing to Aisha. Um, Aisha, please, I'm begging you to forgive Odogo. I know he would have told he should have told you this like you know long ago or you know before instead of you finding out finding things out by yourself. But please forgive Odogo. I know he forgave you the last time when he bought the car for you and you you know you made some comments. This is your turn, Aisha please to forgive Odogo. We all make mistakes. Nobody's above mistakes. Aisha, please. I didn't like the fact that you moved out of the house just because of this. Aisha, please do not let your marriage break just because of this. This happened in the past. That was in 2014. Then Odogo did not even know you. He didn't even know you and you didn't know him. If it had happened when, like after he met you, then I would have really blamed Odogo. But he did not know you when he was dating this girl and when they had a baby. And again, before you even run out, did you get a DNA test? Please, I would like you, Odogo and Aisha, um, take this girl and get a DNA test to make sure it's Odogo's Dora. If she, if she is Odogu's daughter, then Aisha, I'm begging you, embrace your daughter, embrace this girl. I was, I, I cried when you were crying, and then this girl got out, got up from her seat and hugged you and said, "Stop crying." Oh my God, I, I had goosebumps, goosebumps, bumps all over me, and then I, 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 I wept. I wept when I saw when I saw that. Please, Aisha, this girl is already loving you like her mom. Please, and you don't even know God, what God what God's plan is for you. So, this girl could be an angel in disguise. Do not chase her away. Embrace her like a daughter. But my advice to you and Odogu is, please get a DNA test to confirm that this girl. Is really truly Odogu's daughter. Then after that, I know Odogu has been has been apologizing to you, Aisha. Please forgive. To err is human and to forgive is divine. Please forgive Odogu and you guys will let the let bygone be bygone and move on. Okay? Move on. You've been an amazing couple. Uh, sometimes I just look and I tell my husband this marriage was made in heaven do not let your marriage break just for this if it's anything that is not threatening your life aisha please accept your husband back please i know i know he offended you please aisha accept odogu back and you guys should continue from where you stop and like i said before if the dna says um i mean the paternity test if he says odogu is the father please accept the child I mean, in, in, in those days, our grandmothers, um, there would be like, it would be a man marrying 20 women, like or 10 women or something. And, you know, they still tried to live in peace and, you know, everybody moved on. But this is something that happened in the past. It's not like they brought a second woman in the house, like it's a polygamy family, a polygamous family. So this is, where this happened um long ago before Odogu met you and then like he ended up like this and now just accept the girl please accept the girl she she she's an angel in these guys okay she's an angel in these guys so do not let do not let this break your marriage i'm begging you aisha it is not i mean if you allow this to break your marriage, Aisha, you will live to regret it. I'm not wishing you bad, but do not let this. This is not worth it. It's not worth breaking your marriage. Please, please. Um, I've always loved your family. You have your husband, your son. 
and I mean, look at how God has been blessing you. So why would you just let this, what Odogu did in the past, destroy your relationship you've built for years? And like, yeah, let me tell you, Aisha, Odogu genuinely loves you. Please, he is your husband. He, Odogu was meant for you. So don't let this, all the, I see this as distractions. Do not let them de um, destroy your marriage. And a young marriage, you know, most times you will be having all these storms, but it is when you and Odogu, you stand together to push out the storm or any temptation that will try to destroy your marriage. That's when you see marriage gets stronger, the love gets stronger. Like I've been married for 20 years and the key to my long lasting marriage has been love. And then another one is forgiveness. My marriage would have been a history without forgiveness. You just have to have this forgiving heart. And then the man should be able to forgive the woman. The woman should be able to forgive the woman. Um, the man should be able to forgive the woman. And the woman should be able to forgive the man. And that's how you build a very, very strong marriage. Okay? So, Aisha, um, I would like to get the good news that you and Odogu came back together to sort out your issues. And then you continue to, you know, move on from where you stopped. And then your love got, you, the love um got stronger and i pray that god will bind you guys with love that will bind you guys with love that no one can break okay and uh, may god continue to bless you guys more and more and again for the young girl at the end of the day if the dna comes out that odogu is the father please i accept that baby that baby will be a blessing a blessing 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 to you okay you will bring she will bring blessings upon blessings more blessings to your family okay do not reject that child okay um um i wish you guys all the best and i wish uh you have a blissful marriage and i i wish for everlasting love um um between both of you in jesus name Amen. I'm not an evangelist. I don't know for one reason. Something kept pushing me to talk to, to send a video to you and your husband. I mean, to Aisha and the husband. I was so restless. Like other marriages break and, you know, for one reason or the other, like, you know, on social media, we see these things like now and then. I don't, I like to stay in my lane. I don't get in people's business. For, but for Aisha and Odug, I don't know for one reason. I kept, I was so like, something kept pushing me. You need to send a video. You need to send this message to Aisha and Odogu. You need to send. So now that I've made this video, my heart is at peace. I don't know. I think God has been pushing me. So Aisha, please take this advice. Advice. A lot of people might be pushing, oh, Aisha, leave the marriage. Leave. It. Do not leave my sister. Stick to your husband. Stick stick with him and then fight off the devil okay i mean this is not a good reason to break your marriage do not do something you will regret tomorrow i'm not wishing you but but do not leave your marriage just because of what your husband did in the past i love you guys so much and um may god continue to my god continue to comfort you i know like you're so heartbroken but god will really comfort you and then um and may God continue to be with both of you in Jesus' name. Amen. I love you guys. And everybody, please, everybody that watches this video, keep sharing this video until it gets to Aisha and Udugu. Do not let, let's not let their marriage break. Let's encourage them, okay, to come back together. We love you, Aisha. We love you, Udugu. Peace. Love you.